What's up guys? So this video is going to be a little bit different than the other ones. Um, I'm not actually detailing today. I'm going to be running through my website. So if you guys are going to build your own, you can follow along with this video and I'm just going to explain everything that I have on my website and why I wrote it. So I'm going to go ahead and get started right away with the top left. I just have my business name, ACS detailing. And then over here I have home pricing packages, contact, and then a cart, then your little account logo. And then moving down, I just have a nice like eye candy i guess a uh, picture of an audi that i did came out really nice so i had the idea in my head that i'm going to use this picture for my website so i tried to make it as nice as possible for the reason to put it on my website so that's that and then for the header of the entire page this is probably the most important thing about your website i have car detailing from the comfort of your own home so the reason i said that is because you want to keep it as simple as possible you need to think like a customer when you're building your website you don't want to say ceramic coating for vehicle near you you like you you want to make it as simple as possible so car detailing that's very, very simple. That's what somebody's going to look up car detailing near me. And then the, Google will say, okay, this person has a website that says car detailing. So Google's going to go ahead and show them my website because it aligns with the search. And then from the comfort of your own home, immediately, you know that I'm mobile and that I'll clean your car from the comfort of your own home. So in my business name, I don't say I'm mobile. He, like nowhere here I say that I'm mobile right off the bat you understand I'm a mobile detailer and I'll go to your home so hopefully that makes sense next I just have my location serving Worcester Mass and beyond uh, the reason I said beyond is because I thought it was kind of funny I'm not gonna try to keep this page as serious as possible because I hope people can understand that you should add a little bit of humor into it I don't know if you've noticed but a lot of these companies are doing the same thing they'll go on Twitter and they just talk like a regular person in my opinion that's gonna help you out more than you acting like a very strict business so that's why I said that and again if you guys are building your website right now and you see the things that I wrote and you like them and you want to use them feel free to use them because i'm not the first person to think of this there's definitely other people that have said and beyond or from the comfort of your own home whatever feel free to use the things that i'm going to say in this video and then i have a book online button this is a call to action button call to action pretty much means that you're telling somebody to go and do something like if i were to say like this video if you enjoyed that's a call to action which i don't do if you guys have noticed because i don't believe in asking people to like and subscribe on videos because you're on youtube everyone knows how youtube works it's kind of unnecessary in my opinion um but that's just me but on my website i want people to book so i'm gonna tell them book <laughs> so i'm gonna tell them to book online so going down i say why do you choose me so notice i don't say us because i'm not trying to act like i'm a big business this is just me doing this right now so i'm gonna say me if i end up getting somebody to help me out i, I will change it to us but i'm being as honest as possible and i'm not gonna act like somebody i'm not so i say me so if it's just you which i bet if you're watching this video it's just you starting out remember don't overthink it and just be honest on your website don't lie to people uh, it's not going to help you in the long run so going through all these now um, these are just some cards that i made with one to two max sentences that i wrote so first one is our service with a uh, vehicle that i did and it says from wiping down the dash to extracting the carpets i will do what it takes to make your vehicle look brand new so i pretty much just thought what is the most simple and quickest thing that you do to detail a car and i'd i'd think wiping down the dash and then what takes the longest i'd think extracting the carpets or you can say removing dog hair or something i just like the way that this one worked so that's how i thought of this and then i will do what it takes to make your vehicle look brand new kind of self-explanatory I'm just going to put as much effort in as I possibly can to make it look as best as possible. And then another uh, button here that goes to my contact page. Uh, then the middle one for your convenience, uh, I strive to make scheduling a detail as easy and stress-free as possible. I want you to feel confident that you're getting exactly what you're looking for. So 
with the first sentence, I strive to make scheduling a detail as easy and stress-free as possible. I give people multiple options to book a detail. They can either call me and have me book them into my website, or they can text me, or they can just not even talk to me at all and just book something on my website, Facebook Messenger, Instagram DM. There's multiple ways that you can book me to get your car done. So that's what I mean by as easy and stress-free as possible. Then I want you to feel confident that you're getting exactly what you're looking for. That pretty much means I'm gonna answer any question that you're gonna ask me um, at any time. So if you text me at 11 o'clock and I'm still awake, I'm gonna answer you. So that's what that means. And then I have a pricing page that I will talk about soon. And then packages, I offer packages to make it easier for you to decide what you'd like. Prices are dependent on size and condition of vehicle. So this first sentence, I offer packages to make it easier for you to decide what you'd like. Pretty self-explanatory. I offer multiple different packages so somebody can make up their own mind for what it's going to work for them and they can get exactly what they want and then prices are dependent on size and condition of vehicle again i don't want to keep repeating myself but pretty self-explanatory um size it, like compared to a truck to a coupe that's what i mean by size and then condition how bad it is so if it's like straight out of the dealership like very clean or if it's just full of mold and just a bunch of crap um, that's what I mean by that and then another call to action for packages and then under that I say see who you're working with So I recently just started making videos and I decided to put them on my website to see if it would help I like testing a lot of new things with my website and this is one of them. So I pretty much linked um, my page new car new detailing setup so you know um, kind of what I look like uh, how I talk how I act and what vehicle I use and why I use it and what's in it so you know what I'm showing up with and who I am and then this video is to show what I'm going to do to your car and the steps that I take to detail a car and then just a short um, description for both those videos and then underneath that it's stay connected so I just wrote like a quick sentence about uh, social media pretty much saying uh, I I mainly use Instagram to update all my information so you can follow me with this button and then our quality promise. I am committed to providing a stress-free experience to both new and returning customers. If there is ever any issue, don't be afraid to contact me. So um, stress-free just means that you can ask me any question. I'm going to answer it. Don't be afraid to call me up and say that I messed up. Every time I'm done with the detail, I make sure that person double checks it to make sure I don't miss anything because it is a possibility. I'm not, uh, I'm human. I'm not perfect. I'm not, I'm not going to get every single piece of dust out of a vehicle, which you should also think too, that you are not perfect at detailing and just know that there are times that you can mess up. So showing that to somebody else is going to mean a lot more than you just thinking that you're the best at detailing. And then uh, if there is ever any issue, don't be afraid to contact me immediately. I, I've only had one person ever text me about having a, an issue about their car. Uh, they said that it kind of smelled weird after I detailed it, like after about a week. So what I did is I went on Amazon, I bought a odor neutralizer and just sent it straight to their house, no cost to them. And then I asked them about it like a month later and they said it helped and it worked out great. So don't be afraid to help people out. Do not ignore people when they have issues with what you did because they're going to spread that much faster to their friends and family rather than if you did a really good job and they go and tell other people. They're, they're going to tell more people if you did bad than if you did good. So I hope that makes sense. Um, now going to my pricing page. This is pretty much just going over my prices, why I charge what I charge and how I got the price that I got. One thing that I learned this year was you want to answer questions before people ask. And I learned that from the book, They Ask You Answer, which I would highly recommend you read if you want to start your own detailing business or any business in general. It's pretty much just saying that you answer the question before people ask them and why you should, why it's more important. Um, I would definitely recommend that. But what do you think the most important question is or most frequently asked question is with detailing? It's how much does it cost? How much are you gonna charge me? What's the quote? Blah, blah, blah. So with finding that out over time, what I did was I wrote an entire article about it explaining how much it costs and why it costs as much as it does. Uh, I, I'm not gonna read everything here. If you really want to, you can go on my website and read the whole thing. 
uh, starting off I say how much will it cost so the question and then to add some humor to it I said ah yes the most important and frequently asked question how much will my vehicle cost well to keep it short it depends like I said you can go through this and read it if you want uh, I'll just kind of like skip down here so I gave a quick example I said so let's say you have an SUV and you're looking for a full detail you go to book online and you see my price that says starting at 180 this would not mean your SUV is going to be 180. If you think about size, an SUV is much larger than a coupe, meaning it would take more time, which then brings up the cost of the detail. Then let's say you have a dog and the fur needs to be removed. That would also bring up the price of the detail. Hopefully now you can understand the starting at price. So the reason I wrote it out like this was I was trying to think like a customer and if I have an SUV, I'm going to hop on my website and book something and I say and I see starting at 180 and I'm like what's the actual price of my own car because it says starting at that doesn't mean that my price is 180 so um, I was just trying to get into my customers heads think how they do when they're gonna get on my website and wrote a paragraph about it so like I said, just keep it simple. Don't overthink it. And then after you read this whole thing, if you want to get an exact quote about your car, you can go here, get your quote. You just type in your name, your email. Uh, please give a slight description of your vehicle, which you can do right here. And then you can also attach a photo of the car and then send it to me so I can get back to you and tell you um, as best a quote as I can give without showing up next is my packages page probably the most important or second most important to your home page up top i just have a slideshow of cars that i did nothing too crazy just some of the nice cars that came out i just put on the website i would try to keep this as updated as possible and then under it i have online appointments you can um, categorize them all services interior exterior and full details so this first one this is just temporary i'm in november now we're getting into the cold season where it starts snowing i'm from massachusetts so i don't detail in the winter season because it gets so cold and you can't really detail when there's snow and slush on the ground and it's like nine degrees outside so um, i basically put this package on here to <laughs> try to help with more sales towards the end of the season because it starts slowing down. So this is pretty much just the premium package here that's starting at 360 and it offers more and it's only starting at 300. And then I only offered that for the month of October. So um, that's what this package, all these other ones I always have on my website. So the way I set up my packages is I have basic and premium for all of them. So basic, uh, basic interior premium, basic exterior premium, uh, basic full, premium basic uh, doesn't include standard removal or dog care or any protection and then premium offers all of that for pretty much all of them uh, with the exterior there's just more steps involved with the premium than there is with the basic with the exterior and then the full detail just includes both the basic and the basic on the interior and exterior and then the premium is the same thing with the premiums so let's say you have an SUV you want a basic full detail which this is probably my most uh, bought package is the basic full detail. So I pretty much just have a slight description of what I do for the basic interior and then uh, the basic exterior package. They're both just put together. So I say this package includes both basic interior package and basic exterior package combined at a discounted price for your convenience. Uh, what I mean by at a discounted price for your convenience, that's pretty much um, it's it's better for me if I show up and I do both the interior and exterior rather than I show up once just do the interior next week I show up again to the exterior it's a lot better for me because of just the driving and the time and uh, the amount of time it takes to take everything out and put it all back in uh, for my vehicle so that's what I mean by at a discounted price for your convenience they pay a little less when they get both and then uh, basic interior, I just have vacuum and brush on carpet, all plastics cleaned and treated, leather slash cloth cleaned, floor mats cleaned and treated, trash removed, all glass cleaned. And then for the basic exterior foam cannon, two bucket wash method, clean wheels slash tires and wheel wells, tire shine, streak free windows, uh, apply spray wax coating to protect paint. So. I was having a really hard time with listing this like the way that I wanted to because I wanted it to be short and simple but I just couldn't find a way so I ended up just going to some uh, some other detailers website and just kind of seeing what they did and rewording it a little bit so that's why I'm saying you guys can feel free to 
kind of copy what I've used because I've done the same thing and everybody does it. The successful people copy because you're going to spend a lot of time overthinking about it and in the long run you'll waste money when you're going to be thinking and thinking and thinking about what you name your business, what you do with your website, blah blah blah. Just just try to just get it done. It's better to have it out there than have nothing. That's this and then let's say you're on here, you're not 100% sure, you're like, "Ah, it's 180. I don't know if I really need it." You can scroll down a little bit and there's more information to kind of convince them to get it and why it's worth it for them. So I have uh, someone you can trust. No matter if this is your first detail from me or your hundredth, I want you to feel completely comfortable with me around. I guarantee friendliness and honest work. And then packages, your vehicle is an investment and I want to make it last. I provide reoccurring detailing packages at a discounted rate to ensure your vehicle is protected from the elements. Regular cleaning and waxing will extend the look of your vehicle for years to come. So. I don't actually offer a reoccurring package that's something I want to work on very soon so they can just go on my website book it and pay on my website and it's just 200 bucks a month just reoccurring so that, that's something I'm gonna look into but right now this is just kind of a um, mouth to mouth thing if they want to set something up they can talk to me and then we'll work something out and then safety and protection I know your classic and exotic cars deserve special treatment I take extra precaution to each vehicle to ensure safe and thorough cleaning the process of the vehicle will be explained if need be to make sure you're getting exactly what you're looking for so if you've watched any of my other videos I explain that you really want to show up and talk to your customers and treat them like they're your friend and like you've known them don't show up and just get started and say oh good morning and then get going like you want to have some energy in your voice you want to be interested in what they're saying included with like simple oh how's your day how's your morning going blah 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 you um you can also talk about the steps that you take or the steps that you're going to take that day to their vehicle so it's something important you always want to be on your feet uh, with these questions what i actually did before i started was while i was cleaning my car I'd, I'd act like i was making a video i'd say okay now i'm gonna do this now i'm gonna do this this is why i do this just thinking about it beforehand to kind of prepare myself when people ask me questions i can just go ahead and answer them right away so from there i want to show you guys what happens when they actually book a detail so let's say i'm due saturday the 12th at 9 a.m go ahead continue i'll just throw in like a random address random city and numbers and then i'll book that so this is what it'll look like when you're ready to check out with the details so i have you you put in your first your last name your email your phone number all the red stars mean that they're a priority and you have to answer them and then a checkbox for store my information for faster checkout in the future this is just something that came with the website i don't actually think i set that up i might have but um, it, it's basically they fill this out they check this box so when they get another detail they don't have to fill it out again and then additional questions these are very important I would definitely recommend um, setting something up like this if you're able to on your website builder I used GoDaddy so if you guys want to use the same thing definitely set this up for the first question I asked do you have accessible water and power at your house I'm mobile I don't keep power and water in my car I don't want the weight of the water in my car and then I don't have enough space to keep a generator in my car so that's the reason for that and let me tell you nobody has ever gave me a problem with not having water and power in my car so if you're the same as me and you don't carry water and power in your car because you're starting out 100% ask this question whether it's on your website or you're on the phone this needs to be asked before they book something all, all the time because I have lost I think two or three details from showing up and then realizing that they don't have access to power and then it just becomes a problem so i've learned my lesson with that learn from my mistakes and ask this every time so for the next one i have what is the make and model of your vehicle self-explanatory um just so i have an idea and also i like asking because if it's a first-time customer uh, they put their address in and when I show up I want to just make sure I'm at the right house so I see the car in their driveway so it's kind of the reason why I asked that and then uh, please give a slight description of the condition of your vehicle I just want people to say it's not bad uh, it's it's there's some dog hair but no stains just something like that just a basic description 
Uh, so that's pretty much it for that and then they can go ahead and book i don't let people pay on my website they have to pay me after i do it because the price fluctuates like maybe i get there and it's actually way worse than they explained and the price went up 150 dollars. i don't want them to pay on my website and then pay me again so it's not convenient for them so that's just how i do it and then the last page here i have the contact page uh, up here i say contact me again with the me um my business name the area I work out of, and then my actual name, my phone number, my email, and then my hours. So today it's by appointment. I only do it by appointment. I don't accept details the day of. I've had people call me and ask me if I can do it that day. I, I don't do that. I don't work that way and I don't, I don't like it. Some people do, but I just don't. And then just, just more of my hours written out Tuesday through Fridays, closed Saturday, Sunday, Monday, by appointment only. And then they can email me with a question. So the very last section here, frequently asked questions, same thing with the pricing, um, answer the question before they ask it. The first one is what does the full detail mean? When making these answers, I was trying to think as basic and baseline as possible. So this was one of those questions i was like i've had like two people ask me what does a full detail mean so i'm just gonna go ahead and answer it on my website so it just says a full detail is basically interior and exterior combined it is just a shorter way to explain that you want your entire vehicle detailed so it's basically just a description of full detail that i made and then uh, do you need to use my water and electricity? I already went over this, but it says, uh, yes, as of right now, I do not carry water or a generator in my vehicle. Um, I am definitely thinking about getting a generator next year, but it's just not something um, I'm really considering right now because I haven't really lost money not having a generator. And then um, how long will my vehicle take? Each vehicle will take a slightly different amount of time. Under each package, I have listed an estimated amount of time that the detail will take. So um, I don't know if you guys saw, but in my packages, um, underneath all the names, it says three hours, five hours, two, four, five, and eight. So those are all just estimated times uh, they're not exact times, but that's just going with this and answering the question. So I'd say these are the three most important questions right next to the ones that I ask when you book a detail, but that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope this helped. If you have any further questions, please leave them in the comment section and I will try to get back to you as fast as I can.